The foundation of lean management and your continuous improvement journey begins with five disciplines. They are five S's, or commonly known as 5S. But what is 5S, and what do they have to do with your workspace? After viewing this video, you'll have answers to these questions and more, including why is it beneficial? What practices undermine 5S principles? What are the positive results of 5S? We've all encountered disorganized work areas where missing items are hard to find and clutter impedes progress. This interrupts workflows and leads to wasted time, unnecessary spending, and in some cases, unsafe environments. 5S is a method of creating a clean and orderly workspace that exposes waste and makes deviations immediately visible. Each S is derived from Japanese. Seri, or sorting. Seitan, or systematize. Seiso, or shining. Seiketsu, or standardizing. And Shitsuke, or sustaining. 5S is about much more than good housekeeping and can have also major long-term benefits beyond a clean workplace. First, safety and security are placed at the forefront as removed clutter and debris in your facility removes unnecessary hazards. Second, 5S helps to eliminate waste. Third, it increases efficiency as people are more productive when they are working in a clean and organized work environment. Fourth, 5S has a low implementation cost with a high impact on performance, meaning you'll get important benefits without high spending. Finally, when you set a team working together in the 5S system, they'll develop the collaborative mindset that makes all of your other initiatives more successful. How is all this achieved? By methodically implementing each 5S discipline. Begin by implementing the sorting stage. This is the act of categorizing items into those necessary and unnecessary, and then eliminating unnecessary items. Sorting challenges to think carefully about what we no longer need in order to eliminate waste. If you don't need it, get rid of it. Even in the office setting, this can mean eliminating old files. After you finish sorting, it's time to systematize your workspace by placing all necessary items in their optimal positions. This forces you to carefully visualize your work area in order to understand how the placement of materials complements your workflow. It will also cause you to see current deviations that can be corrected. Shining means cleaning to inspect. When you've identified deviations during the systematized step, you're also identifying the problems that can be eliminated during the shining process. Problems can be inspected to identify the source of the error and develop countermeasure to get back on track for 5S optimization. This is also a good practice in problem solving that can become a work culture improvement in the future. Once you have completed the first three disciplines, you can now begin to develop standardization. This means that you need to develop rules in order to duplicate your optimized processes every time. It also means that you can share the process with everyone on your team and quickly onboard new associates to the best possible workplace practices. To do this, you will Divide tasks into simple steps that don't require checklists when necessary. Perform the steps in the same way each and every time in order to more easily identify systematic breakdowns and continue to replicate success. Provide the items needed to efficiently and successfully complete the process every time. Now that you've established a standard process, you'll need to sustain the practices, which is far easier said than done. Making the processes a habit so that associates follow standards as second nature is the type of self-discipline that sustains success brought on by 5S. To cause this habit forming continually, look for waste. Visualize the work area and look for deviations. Look for the root cause of every problem that arises. Develop standards. Repeat the process. Remember, the ultimate goal of 5S is continuous improvement. The 5S process is a proven driver of efficiency and success across a wide variety of businesses and work areas. It can be implemented in any workspaces, including maintenance shops, offices using digital files, meeting rooms, storage areas, art areas, manufacturing facilities, 
The list goes on. But the success of major businesses using 5S should be evidence of its effectiveness. Industries including healthcare and charitable organizations use 5S. 5S also has been a valuable tool to giant retailers like Amazon and restaurants like McDonald's. You're likely already forming some idea of how Toyota puts 5S into practice. Formalize your ideas by implementing 5S in a specific work area. Identify a challenging area. Remove unnecessary items and then organize it in a systematic way. Then continuously look for problems and develop countermeasures on your way to standardizing those systematic processes. Finally, develop the self-discipline necessary to sustain your optimized practices. In your workspace, you can carefully implement these guiding principles to eliminate waste and improve efficiency. And in the long term, keep your associates happy and healthy. Your workplace is clean and your profits growing. You can imagine it. Now let us help you achieve it.